What can happen if you started to invest $1,000 per month into the S&P 500? According to officialdata.org, since 1926 the average annual total return for the S&P 500 has been about 10% per year. But if you started investing $1,000 per month starting from today, then how much money can you actually make from this investing strategy assuming the 10% return per year? On year 1, your total investments are $12,000, ending investment balance is $12,640. On your first year, you have made $640, which is okay, but on the year 10, your total investments are now $120,000, ending investment balance is $201,457. You can see that your profits are getting more serious now. On year 20, your total investments are $240,000, ending investment balance is $723,986. Now you can see that the power of compound interest is really starting to take off for you, but on year 30, your total investments are $360,000, ending investment balance is more than $2 million. Congratulations, you are now officially a millionaire, but if you somehow manage to wait another 10 years after that, then on year 40, your total investments are $480,000, ending investment balance is more than $5.5 million. This is of course nothing that I can guarantee, but historically speaking, then 10% per year over a long period of time is quite realistic on the S&P 500. Thank you for watching and have a great day.